Holy shit, it's real. We're actually doing this. It's a real game. It actually came out and everything. So I'm gonna go with the default stuff, but I unlocked hero, villain for Leon, casual, <laughs> romantic. These are all like for the deluxe edition stuff. I get some sporty sunglasses as well. Ashley's default, she's got punk outfit. And she's got it, which is kind of cute, actually. I'm not gonna lie, I like that one. Filters. Oh, that's cool. Villain like changes the sky. And then like original music on off. Oh, should we start in hardcore? I don't want to, but it's too late. I didn't I didn't put hardcore in the title of the video, so let's just go standard. <clears throat> so hyped. Yeah, I got an expanded treasure map as well. And I got, um, for the Deluxe Edition, like, some, uh, like, for the attaché case, um, a couple different models for the case itself, and then some, like, charms you can hang off it or something. <laughs> Brutal. September 30th, 1998. It's a day I'll never forget. The cop inside me died that day. And that night, Raccoon City was wiped out, thanks to the bioweapons created by Umbrella. Somehow I made it out, but too many others weren't so lucky. I was asked later to join a top secret government program. Not that I had a choice. The training, punishing missions, nearly killed me. But at least I kept my mind off everything. If I could just forget what happened that night, the pain, even for a second, this time, it can be different. It has to. So tell me, Yankee, why did you come to this horrible place? As close to nowhere that I've ever seen. Let's just say, looking for someone. That someone must be very important, huh? The chief gave the orders himself. Help him, he said. Well, I'm sure your boys didn't come all the way out here to roast marshmallows. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe you did. You have a strange sense of humor. I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. Just between us. Some weird audio hiccup. A lot of people have gone missing around here. And it's been that way for a while now. Well then. Should be just another day in the office, right? Hmm. I mean, last week there was a search for some missing hikers. I'm sure you'll do your best to help me. <laughs> Hey, 
think this is it. Nature calls, huh? I'll be right back. <sighs> yeah. Qué frío. ¿Te has bebido el bar entero? You smoke? Got gum. Vaya sitio más tétrico. Hey. ¿Hay alguien ahí? He sure is taking his time. Did he fall in? Maybe you better go and take a look. You can't use the did he fall in joke. He's not using a toilet. Oh, watch the car. Wouldn't want to get a parking ticket. Maybe he fell so into the for helping me. Yeah. My partner's missing. You. Stranger to these lands. Go look for him. Oh shit, right into gameplay. He's got like knuckle plates on his fucking gloves too, holy shit. <sighs> what if I go back? You're like, I don't see him, let's go. Found a boat. Why do you wander so far away to piss? Classic crow sound. That's a sound effect for crows since like the fucking first Resident Evil. Far could he have gone? That's what I'm saying. <sighs> yes, it's a dead deer. <sighs> it's very dead. <sighs> Whoa. How weird. Okay, so clicking in the left joystick runs, but R so does R1. But if I do back in R1, he'll do a full spin. Whereas sprinting backwards just sprints towards the camera. It also automatically adjusts the camera behind me if I'm facing away from it. Crow bros. Anyone home?
judgment is nigh. Ciacera el Juicio. <laughs> Juicio. Hello. Uh, sorry to barge in like this. Busco a un policia. Vino aquí? Sorry, dude. Didn't mean to fucking break your neck. This is not good. Mario Fernandez Castano. Very dead. Is that a bunny? No, bunny harm. Man, that stinks. That's a big fucking rat. situation is uh, I'm fucking dying over here. No, Mario. What was that? No 
fucking way. Oh god. <clears throat> this just keeps getting worse. Already lost health. Already have low ammo. Might want to start sneaking. Under one. Hunnigan here. What's your sit rep? Hunnigan. President's daughter, Baby Eagle. It's likely she's in this village. Our intel was correct then. Well done. Need a location on a nearby lake. She may have been taken there. Copy that. I'll see what I can find. Hurry up. Something's happened to the people here. My escorts are. <laughs> Gotta go. Talk later. I'll let myself out. Nice. Got money. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I like that he just kicks the barrel. I should have fourteen bullets, shouldn't I? It says plus one. Is that like one in the chamber? Because I reloaded before the clip was empty. That's pretty cool, if that's the case. <laughs> okay, night. There's a storage as well. Oh, wow. And I already got some shit in it. Fully customized handgun for tackling bioterrorism, specifically for zombies. Its accuracy and versatility make it a reliable choice. Hell yeah, wait, I'm with. Want a fucking double barrel sawn off? Jeez. Alright, so yeah, I got a gold and leather. Oh, the regular one increases the drop rate for handgun ammo. This one is the drop rate for money, and this one is the drop rate for gunpowder. How funny. Handgun ammo rare, 30% handgun ammo craft bonus frequency. 15% health recovery from green herbs. Wow. I can equip multiple. Oh shit. Do I want gunpowder, money, or handgun ammo? Probably just handgun ammo right now, right? <laughs> Let's 
probably just leave it with the regular attach, I guess. But should I take these? Seems kind of cheap to have them right away, but... Maybe I'll just keep them on hand. So satisfying. <laughs> so sad. So I'm so glad they brought that back. <clears throat> oh, it's really accurate. Are you kidding? Look how much I'm wobbling with it. I wobble quite a bit with this as well. <clears throat> Yeah, it says I have 11 out of 3 here, but in the bottom right it says I have 10 out of 3 plus 1, so I think they keep 1 in the chamber when you reload. That's pretty cool. See, if I shoot this crow, does the plus 1 go away? It does. And I can reload it back in. you gurgling. Yeah. Well, the knives do have durability in this game. That's something I know. <coughs> sorry, I shouldn't use it too. I'm sorry. <coughs> it's half gone. Oh my god. Damn it. Did that do health damage? Fuck. He folded right up. <sighs> Dude. Luckily, I, like, I'm so glad that I'm recording this outside of OBS. So that, like, the frame issue won't be an issue when I upload to YouTube, but for fuck's sakes, dude, I cannot stream. It, like, I can't. I can never have a fucking perfect flawless stream without something fucking going wrong. Like, it's fucked. I think he's dead. It's just a hunch, though. <sighs> Cannot sprint while crouched.
If you sneak past, can you avoid the whole scenario? Oh no, this guy's not gonna let ya. Go with my classic routine. I'm gonna see if my old strat works. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. It's my lucky day. Push that. Boy. Oh God. Get off my roof. Next. Give me a break already. Fucking It's Uncle Joe from Seven. You gotta be kidding me. Can I see the way that lady fell back off the roof? Oh god. Huh? The old strat kinda works. They don't fall off the roof as easily. La campana. El nos invoca. But I did get the chainsaw guy and loot his emerald. So that's there's that. Where's everyone going? Bingo.
Where's everyone going? Bingo? He said the thing. He said it. Think it's too late for that guy? Think I can cut him down? <sighs> Alright. Route Secondor 1. I've identified a route to the lake. Look for a large windmill. There's a path on the far side of it. Windmill. Copy that. And be careful. Roost out. What the f- What the fuck? Or what the fuck were you doing in there? You're supposed to go to bingo. Is it like a lock pick? Interesting. So I know from the trailers and like, I, I didn't play the demo, but I saw other people play it. And there's like the lantern with the cow you can set on fire, but they're not, either they're not here in the full game, or after the whole village encounter, you like miss the opportunity and they despawn. How funny. But I like to think of it as I saved the cow and the cow got to go to a better farm. Where people aren't fucked up. That's my role play, and I'm sticking to it. Isn't there a yellow herb here in the original? Or is that the second time you come back here? Ooh, what's this? Ornate necklace. It looks like an emerald can fit in that. Wow, cool. Yeah. Oh. What the fuck? There's like a whole fucking like poker hands of how much money you get for combining gems with stuff. How interesting. An extraordinarily opulent necklace. Unfortunately, most of the jewels have been removed. Can be inlaid with certain gemstones. 16,000 patas. So it's the value of the necklace without any gemstones is 11,000. And specifically putting in an emerald added five. Five gemstones of different colors. So I assume like certain gemstones are less rare, like by color. Because it seems to be the colors that determine it, not the shape. 
The shape is just what size, like, because there's two square and two circle on the necklace, right? But it's specifically the colors that determine the value. Seems to be running a lot better, eh? There must have been just like one specific setting that I had like maxed out, which I shouldn't have. There's another one, bam. Another 3,000. And then the two colors bonuses add 1.1 times. So the red circle is worth 3,000. So it's 19,000 total, and then times 1.1 1 .1 is 20,900. That's pretty cool. <clears throat> kind of gives you like, oh shit. And then after you use key items, instead of just throwing them away, you can sell them. This key is valued at 1,000. That is neat. Everything has value to the merchant. There it is. So I'm assuming this would be like, yeah, this is that other place with all the piggies. There's no gem in the well this time. I don't see blue medallions either. Oh, I take that back. There are five here. Makes me feel like something's gonna burst out of there. No, don't just that. issue of them bursting out is an issue of them bursting in. Oh dear god. Uh, do I have the gear for this? First of all, let's start combining some of this shit. shit goes in here as well. Let's get some fucking shoddy ammo. Oh 
Oh my god, he's fast. So this is the new guy that they were talking about before. Here you go. Oh god. that a little too close to your buddy there buddy ah fuck come here grandpa oh that's how you counter Countering doesn't use durability, but I feel like once my knife breaks, which will probably be soon, if I use it in any other way, then I won't be able to counter anything. So I should probably only use it for countering now. Chicken egg. Classic. I could have saw a medallion. Oh, there it is. I don't see a note about the medallions this time, so it's kind of interesting, like... Either it's around here somewhere, or... They just straight up expect you to remember from the original that you have to shoot some here. to the windmill. Seems not. <coughs> There's one right there. down on that side? Oh. New puzzles. What is that beeping? Is that a tripwire? Flagging. So Flagon holds two circular gemstones, so we'll put the other ruby here. It's like, uh, that was the beer stein in the original. <laughs> Here's the note about them. Destroy the blue medallions. 
For the love of God, will someone please get rid of the blue medallions those religious lunatics left hanging around? Request. Destroy all the blue medallions. Area. Farm. Reward. Three spinels. Progress four to five. I'm only missing one. And I would assume that one would be near the note, right? Actually, in the old game, you can see him on the map. Yeah! It's actually over here. Aha! I assume I get I'm assuming a lot but I'm gonna assume that you get rewarded from the merchant A yellow. My God. All right. It's awesome because it's new, right? That is a dead pig. That's a dead moo moo. Lago. Link's it's gotta late. be this way. <laughs> Link's gotta be this way. Because that sign says so. I can read. <laughs> But I want in. There's gotta be a way in, right? <coughs> We're about to come back here with Ashley. I might have to come back here with Ashley. Lift her over the gate. Holy shit. It's 
It's a good thing I started going this way before I got in that way. Nice try, losers. Oh. you come from? Okay, so they do that instead of sending the boulder after you and having you mash a button to run away from it. Get your flashlight out, Leon. This is a very dark tunnel. Vampires. Come closer. Ow. Oh my god, I kicked his leg off while he was stuck in the bear trap. Dude, that's awesome. God damn it. Oh, what? Notice, didn't notice. Uh, and there goes my knife. But don't worry, I have a kitchen knife. I have a backup kitchen knife. Trying to make some people steaks. Throw that over the house. I was trying to throw it in the roof. Where are you? Yeah. 
Whoa, is this the lake? How interesting. Oh, look, there's a castle. So is this like this is this a way I can get back here when I fight the giant lake monster? Think I can <coughs> ride the boat back across? Was there too. Another one of those. All right, Lewis, I'm this coming. This the place. Zom zoms in here. And a dog. Is that kid Salazar? Be so funny. What's that noise? <sighs> it's not Lewis in a cabinet, they changed it. Oh. Hi. What? Yo, that bullet grazed his ear and he didn't even notice. You fucking prick. Stay down. Kitchen knife durability blows. He's probably down there though. That's what he's trying to get at, right? really want to talk. How observant, senor. Now, uh, say, uh, you got a smoke? You know, those things will kill you. Oh, well, maybe just untie me then, huh? Oh, there! Not this guy! Who are you? The big Stop cheese! Right there. Chapter end. <laughs>